The low number of the earthquakes in the recent days in the Schwarzenegger volcanic system of the Reykjanes Peninsula in the Iceland uh, indicates that there is little movement uh, due to the lateral displacement of the magma. What we are seeing as tremors even those are small amounts aside, is mostly due to the bad weather, as you can see here on these seismograms. Magma accumulation, on the other hand, is continuing, but is not reaching the threshold of 23 million cubic meters that we need for that. The volume uh, of the previous eruption, that was that amount. We have to surpass that, and we are not still there. And even if, we, if we, uh, we, we reach that, we have to wait a few more weeks. This is due to the uh, necessity of shaking of the magma. Magma is a non neutronic fluid like, a, uh, like ketchup. It needs earthquakes to become more fluid and, and flow. And in the absence of that, the hazard to the, due to the uh, eruption imminent eruption is unchanged it stays the same and this is what the Icelandic Meteorological Office has said I predicted that the eruption will be in the early December and unlike what Meteorological Office on that time said I, my prediction it seems is coming true the Icelandic Meteorological Office has updated this prediction the magma movement uh, leading to eruption it's very likely that it will not happen in, a, in the November. We will not have the eruption in the November. December is the likely date for that. So the eruption, if it happens, may happen in December, even closer to the Christmas than we may think. Probably we will have a Christmas eruption. I played that other video, and you can listen to my prediction on that time. Although everyone is waiting for the next eruption in the Sundunka crater chains of the Reckonis Peninsula of Iceland, at the moment the level of the earthquakes is low. We can see it at the depth that there is not much earthquakes under the Blue Lagoon, Swartzengig and Grindavik areas. Although we have lots of seismic activity in the clear war for what, where the Christophic volcanic system is. We need earthquakes for the magma to be able to flow. That's a non neutronian fluid. And we know that the magma is there. The magma needs to flow. And is at, at the moment is accumulating, just adding to the mass underground, lifting the earth crust slightly. We can measure it by the GPS uh, satellites. And when we plot them, and I will show you here, this is the Icelandic Meteorological Office, previously was from the University of Iceland, you can see that. And, we, and if we extrapolate based on the previous eruptions, from this point onward, we come to the conclusion that the next eruption will be by the early December. Uh, Icelandic Meteorological Office believes it be maybe next uh, eruption will be around the late November. Uh, my belief is that probably it will be around uh, December and onward, early December. That's the extrapolation based on that uh, uh, curve that they showed. That means the shaking of the magma will create an eruption. We will have something like what we had previously in that area. Of course, that will be an, a time that we will have a snow on the mountains and a chain of craters may form. Build up of pre building up of pressure is high. We may have something like what we had previously. The risk assessment stays the same. The only practical risk is that people may fall in the cracks and crevices in the Grindavik and the surrounding areas. And the summary as presented by the Icelandic Meteorological Office is this. Of course, end of November is their assessment. My assessment at the moment is the early December. Based on the extrapolation from the previous uh, eruptions that we have, and I plotted it on, on that diagram, I showed it, I believe that the next eruption will be in December, early December probably, most likely. We need still a lot of magma to build up and the land to rise. Every time it's getting more difficult. Eventually this eruption will happen, but after that we think and I believe in that uh, in 2025, probably we'll have eruption in the Krisovic volcanic system. 
it may get activated we see a lot of uh, activity in that area and uh, I will also make a video later about that